The Gans of Ghana are a very peaceful and lovely people. They are often associated with drumming. No wonder there is a yearly ban on noise and drumming. But you see, it is not just that they are associated with drumming, just like every other tribe is also associated with drumming. But you see, there are specific rituals that go with the beautiful people of the Ghana land. It is the prerogative of every clan to play these special drums. Just as it is with governance structure, leadership of these clans must acknowledge any, any installed manche or king and accord him all the necessary respect and grant him the right to their abode. It is for this reason that there is one special ritual that is called Krokoto Weshamu. It took place on the 2nd of July 2023. This rite was performed by the Sakumo, Wulomo, Numo, or Ogbami the Third, and accompanied by some elders and, and supported by the Gan Paramount Jasi elders. And they performed the necessary rituals to officially usher the Gan Manche into the Krokoto royal abode. Also present at the short but impressive ceremony were elders of the Krokotowe, namely Ni Aibunte Aite Nalai. Ni Aya Aiti, ex warrant officer class one, Enoch Aikui Aiti, and Ni Aiti Nalai, and many others. These are prominent elders of the Krokotowe family. The Krokotowe drums are the original drums played before and after ban on drumming and noise making in Ghana. Yes, and in fact, in Accra, they are the legitimate. Drummers for every traditional rites of the Gamanche. The presence of the elders of the Krokotowe and the playing of the Krokoto drums to lead the king to their ancestral legitimacies. The process and all the things that were done, including the slaughtering of ram and the blessing of the king and pouring of libation, were all done by the Sakumo Wulomo. Numo Ogbami the third.